are you ready to witness Mrs. Means by Mel? It's controversial. Battle of the Brands. Woo -woo. Garnier edition. First introducing and weighing in at 300 milliliters. Despite being affordable, this brand is considered whole and blended. It's the Garnier Whole Blends with some sugar for us today. Hit it. Um. Melly on the beat. I am whole and then some. Benefit that curly momentum. I got the goods for what's under your hood. Treat you like royalty, cause I got the royal jelly. And you can trust me, cause I'm from the beast. I'm here for a strong time, not a long time. And the other mask is the wrong kind. Three minute minutes, smooth on your tresses. Rinse away her stresses. I got a strong message. Don't get too attached. I rinse up pretty fast. This will be an easy match. I will beat the tutti fruity fruit this fruit shits because I'm ruthless. Whole blends on that new shit. Uh. Ooh. We are hearing a lot of disrespect over on the whole blend side. Not to mention some aggression. But now, coming at us from the other corner and weighing in at 400 milliliters, naughty and natural, the one minute mask declared to do it all for you. Welcoming Garnier Fructus. And I am through with this unhealthy shit 98% decent Naturally derived ingredients More meal, more life I can be your curl's wife I will always be there Because I care So rinse me or keep me Just don't ever leave me out I'll keep the damage away No other way Than by saying nay To the next day Silicones, parabens, and colorants, okay? We keep it vegan So we can be great again Don't hate, create Healthy your waist. We keep it all fruity. Lots of love to you, cutie. Fruit this out. Me. Means by Mel. Mel, your main girl. Front and center with the lights, the camera, and all the action. This time we are located inside the shower. It has been a hot minute. Um here we take a look at my hair I mean she looks good but how does she feel how do you feel it's a higher porosity because it's been chemically treated so I guess you could say the damage has already been done which means it's time for a treat meant it's time to face off once again with the black hole split down the middle comparing one product on one side and another product on the other side. This is my favorite way to compare products because I get to test them both on my head at the same time. So there's an even comparison, no advantage, and I can literally see one result versus the other. Today I wanted to use two different products that are both in the same price range. These are actually both from the same manufacturer, but they are different brands. Also to make it as even as possible. We have introducing, in case, you didn't get it from the intro. Garnier Whole Blends versus Garnier Fructus. Mm-hmm. So let's compare and contrast, shall we? Okay, so to prep my hair, the first thing I'm gonna do is clarify. Today I'm gonna be using Ferb Clarifying Shampoo, one of my favorites. The best way to try out a new product to really see how it's gonna work for you is by clarifying your hair. Starting on a clean slate, making sure that there's no residual products from anything else you were using, just fresh, clean hair. I like to do this anytime I'm trying a new product, from shampoo, conditioner, deep conditioner, leave-in, styler. I always like to do a fresh, clarifying wash. Okay, so it seems that the main difference between these two masks is one of them is 
curly girl approved, whereas the other is not quite technically curly hair approved. But which one will the curls approve? Only time will tell. I'm going to start off with the whole blends because whole blends is to be left on the hair, it says for three minutes, whereas the other mask is a one minute. So while this is sitting on, I will apply the other. So my hair is already sectioned off, right? Because I'm doing half and half. You may want to be sectioning your hair if your hair is very thick. The more sections, the better. You're just going to be more thorough. But some people may not even have to section. So here I am with half my head. And let's see. Well, I don't need that much product for this, right? Let's take a look inside the jar. Oh. It's a very nice light smell, which is nice. Got some stick in there, some sticky action, and she, she ain't jiggling. She is tick. Okay, good, good sign. The thicker the better in some cases. That means I will t probably need less of this one. So I'm gonna be taking my amount here. I'm gonna go in with like this. Can we see it? Do you believe it? First, distribute it on my hands, so once I go into apply, it's already getting everywhere. I really try to avoid plopping it all in one area, because then it's just, it doesn't make sense. It's harder to work through after. And my hair has already been kind of damp drying already, so I try not to apply deep conditioners on soaking, soaking wet hair, because um, then, well, depending on the ingredients, the water may prevent it from absorbing into the hair. Because if it's very oil-based, then it's going to just repel oil, oil and water repel. So, you know, it's, it's not dripping, but still nice and wet. Go in, make sure she is saturated. And once I start kind of working it through my hair, it feels nice so far. I do want to grab a little bit more, which is totally fine. Take a little bit more. Make sure I get up here. Always starting my ends first. This is a hair mask, so I'm not putting it on my scalp. Work, work it into the hair. I will now detangle, and I have my wet brush to detangle. Always starting on the ends in this scooping motion. This is obviously the best time to detangle your hair because there is slip, it's manageable, and we are working through. So remember, this is the one that has silicones in it. This is my detangling process. She's in. She's smooth like butter. That feels fantastic. To let that sit, I'm going to just very loosely twist my hair. When you are especially retraining damaged curls, twisting it can help to kind of retrain the curls. It's uh, definitely just kind of like an optional step, but twisting is good. It's also gonna keep it out of the way. It's a very simple twist. Now let's get a first impression on the fructus. Okay, but I need to be quick because this is a three minute mask. You know, if I go a little overboard three minutes, I should be fine, but if it's saying to rinse out thoroughly, I'm gonna be rinsing this out thoroughly and soon. Don't want to be over moisturizing my hair. As for the minute mask, let us see. This is the no silicone, no paraben. They both don't have parabens, but this is the no silicone and it's 98% naturally derived. Mm hmm. Also, a very nice light smell. That's what I like about these. They're not like overly perfumey, it's more fruity. It's, it's a papaya mask. This is. Oh, yeah. I dropped the lid. This is the papaya extract, which I'm smelling. Very nice and light. Oh, this one definitely has a little bit more jiggle. It, it's gonna pour out. So it's more liquidy. It's a little runnier. Whoa! That was a bit much. I, I don't wanna be using all that. I'm gonna go in with this much for my head. It's about the same that I used on the other side. Remember, I had added more. Let me just put this down. First impression, yeah, it's definitely runnier. Still feels nice and silky though. So I'm distributing it onto my hands and beginning to work through. This one's definitely, it's a little bit harder to distribute into my hair. I feel like it's not just melting in like the other one did. I'm going in 
You can detangle. Okay, she's in. Feels all right. Pretty comparable. I don't know, man, did you check out the time of the video? Let me know if that uh, took longer to detangle or not. But we're through. Looking good. We'll twist this up. I will give it one minute to sit in and I will thoroughly rinse both sides and then we will compare whole blends versus fructus when it's completely wet and then I'm gonna let it air dry for a bit with just naked curls, nothing in the hair, just to see what the difference is. They, they both feel good. I'm gonna rinse now. It looks like we have some mineral buildup on here. Amanda, you really need to clean your shower head. But anyways, we'll save that for another video. Just kind of separate the curls a bit because I want to see how the curls are going to dry. So I'm very loosely styling. I'm not going to do any more brushing. Uh, just some finger detangling and no further manipulation. Squeeze out the water. Hold lens. Fructus. Whole blends, fructus, who dis? I'm Mel and I'll be back in a few. Peace. All right, everybody. Naked hairs. I have lived with this for 10 hours. I went about my day like this, went out to work like this. And honestly, she's not even that bad. But this is Naked Curls. Basically, just like I left off, I didn't do anything to my hair. I had showed you the last little bit of kind of finger detangling after rinsing all the product out. That was it. I did not touch my hair whatsoever. I did not use any further product. I did not further manipulate my hair. I left it to air dry and go. And my hair dried fairly quickly because it's high porosity and I did not put any product in it. So water just evaporated. Okay, let's let's dive in. Let's let's break it down. Let's try to compare again. This was Whole Blends, and this was Garnier Fructus. My hair does feel very soft. I do want to point out to you guys, I think a lot of you uh, mistaken rough feeling hair with dry hair because your hair is so textured. And if it is a higher porosity, it's always going to feel a little bit rougher. It's your cuticle. It's all roughed up. So for me, my hair is soft, but it still is not like... It's not silky. I mean, look at it. And when I take a look at the one minute mask side as well, same situation. But the best way to tell so that you're not deceived and confused by your texture is by testing it. We are going to now do the elasticity test. So we are going to take a strand of hairs and I want to grab a strand from both sides that is even. We'll grab it from uh, these little bang curls. Now the goal here is to hold the hair with even pressure on both sides. And then you wanna stretch the hair. You should be able to feel it kind of give a little bit, like an elastic. If you do that and your hair snaps, well then you need to take things back a bit. Your hair definitely needs more moisture. It could also need protein as well. But if it's really just lacking moisture, sure, it's gonna be dry. It's gonna have poor elasticity and brittle. It's gonna be brittle and break. This is not a good thing. Or it may stretch and stretch and stretch. Very stretchy and doesn't bounce back. If it's not bouncing back, there's too much moisture. My hair on this side definitely bounced back. I mean, let's give it a try on this side. Yeah, it, it feels fairly the same as well. Now your hair is not gonna stretch and stretch and expand. It's literally by like a millimeter. I would say from a, an external view, not about how it feels, but how it looks. Again, this was not styled, but the whole blend side seems to be a little bit frizzier, where the one minute mask gave me some pretty decent definition. So I feel like if I'm gonna choose, I'm gonna choose the one minute mask. I mean, not only is it a dollar cheaper, but you get multiple benefits out of it. You can leave it in if you want. Um, it's also vegan and it's 98% naturally derived. See, one of the ingredients that I also really like in this mask was the amla. 
Amla is a hair thickener. It's derived from a fruit. Amla is a fruit and it helps to thicken the strands of your hair. So that is great. And it has a nice light fruity smell. This has been a very interesting test. A little anticlimactic. I wish there was more of a difference for you guys. The one thing that I really wanted to focus on and compare with these products was that one had silicones and the other one did not. And I wanted to see what the difference would make in a deep conditioner. And when it comes to this test, when it came to these products, <laughs> guys, it didn't make much of a difference. So I choose the papaya one. So if you're looking for a good affordable deep conditioner, I tried it, I can now approve it, I can now recommend the Garnier one minute mat. And that is that. As always, I want to thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope you found this video interesting, informative, helpful, and, and, and best of all, entertaining. Make sure you leave in the comment section below what video you want to see next, or if you have any further questions for me, I look forward to hearing from you. I will be sure to see all of you next and every Tuesday with a brand new video. TGIT, everybody. All right, everybody, this one is great. And first, let's just look at my hair one more time while we're here. She definitely could have gone a couple more days, but we must film. Ah! She's cold. Can we get some hot water in here, please? Mommy! Are you doing the dishes or something? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And now, can you stop pissing? These roots, these roots. I'm bleeding. And you can treasure me, cause I'm from the bees, and I got the trees, and I'm from the bee, hop it up, bee, 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 b